What's up guys, it's me the Dolphin Attic and welcome back to the second part of my Pokemon Alpha Sapphire Egglock where I have finally got all of my eggs. Take a gander, all two and a half boxes, you guys done really well. Um, so now I'll just explain what I have done. Um, I have used my power saves to good use. Um, basically, I've, I think I've made all these eggs pretty much like instant hatch. Um, and I've also given myself 999 rare candies to level them up to whatever level the Pokemon in my party I swap them for is. And so we've got Torchic here, level 9. So whatever I swap Torchic for, uh, the egg when it hatches will be level 9. Uh, Zigzagoon level 2. And Lotad level 5. And hey, he's holding an item. I'm going to take that. No idea what the mental herb does, but it'll do. So without further ado, let's pick our first two eggs. Because I need one Pokemon. So I'm going to leave Torchic. I'm going to leave the one that will be the highest level to last. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to pick uh, one from this box. And one from this box. And we'll hatch them. We'll see what happens. See if the hatching has worked. And if not, it has. Hooray. Thank you, Power Saves, for saving so much time. The first Pokemon of the Egglock is... We'll say this is the one that Lotad was. And it is a... Cypher. Not bad at all. Not exactly what I needed for the first gym, but hey, can't moan with a cypher, can I? So what can I call um, this cypher? I have absolutely no idea. This is going to be my downfall. I do not come up with good nicknames. Um, I have no idea what to call him. You know what, I'm going to call him... I'll call him Sizz. Purely because my gay love for Sizz, I mean... He evolves into Scizor and then, you know, I know, I know, no, an even better one. Sis, I'm not really gay for you, man. I was kidding. I was kidding. You're now Scythe Awesome. Right, so we'll check that out in a minute. And the second egg is going to hatch. Hooray, so the, the cheating thing worked, which is fine. So that Scythe is going to be what's level 5. This egg is going to be what's level 2. Hopefully it's something good. It is... Ooh, a Shinsino. Or a Mincino, rather. Mincino. Cool! I'm looking forward to using this. I haven't used one of these very often before. Um, no. I'm happy with that, to be honest. So now, um, let's level them up quickly with the rare candies. Um, all 999 of them. So awesome. Oh, wait, I forgot to nickname Mincino. Poop. Okay, we'll, we'll, we'll change his nickname when we get to, uh, Slateport. Never mind. Alright, I can tell this one's IV bred already. Plus four attack. Not bad at all. I want, I want to see what attacks he has. I don't know what. Focus energy and Minchino can be level two. Now, guys, it is for the moment of a Taroof. Our main. This is basically going to be our starter egg. That I want to carry this one through to the end. So we'll go from box three and I'll pick. I'll pick that one. Guys, what could it be? What could this egg be? It's going to be level 9. It's going to be the powerhouse of the team. Do not be a, a physical chancy, please. Do not be a physically offensive chancy. That would... I'd just kill myself. I would go jump off a cliff that isn't anywhere nearby. Oh, a whole lucha. Hey, I'm happy with that. That will help for the first gym. That's good because Minchino and... Right, I, I, can, nick, I can nickname you. Um, what, what should I call whole lucha? I don't know. I'm going to call you Luchette, because, yeah, I don't know why. There's a word I've just made up. It's like a female luchador. Right then, let's get him up to level 9. I see, uh, um, what's his face? L uh, Luchette being a Pokemon that could be very handy in the first gym, despite being... Did I just get plus 4 special attack? I don't know. I must have. Oh, I don't know. Let's get him up to level... Karate Chop, hooray! We have something that can... Hits rocks and for super effective damage. Thank you. Right, level 6. Level 7. Level 8. And wing attack. Hey, that's good. I have got two flying types on my team already, though. What do you know? Detect, tackle, home claws. Hey, I'm happy with that. Well, let's get rid of tackle. Get rid of tackle. And then one more level for Luchette, and we are ready to go on our adventure. Now, I want to see if these are my Pokemon or not, because it c could have a little problem otherwise. We might have a problem. I'm pretty sure the OT should be me, and if OT is original trainer. Uh, yes, it is. That's fine. 
Uh, ooh, nice and jolly nature. Nice and adamant nature. Nice and something. But hey, you have skill link. You have technician. And you have unburden. So, I'm happy with that. I'm happy. Um... And you're in a quick ball, which is even better. I like that. I like that. So thank you to whoever sent them in. I think Luchador... Um, Luchador? Um, well, Lucha was from Josh, a.k.a. Squirtacular. So I'm looking forward to using that. Cypher, I have no idea. And Minchino, I also have no idea. So, time to go and, uh, well, breed some people up, I guess. Breed some people up. Level some people up. Oh, wait, we can actually go catch a Pokemon in this next route. We can't catch anything in Petalburg City yet. I'll just have to remember to come back. Because uh, there's only water you can catch in. So, let's find something in this grass and change it for an egg. What could it be? What could it be? Actually, Hawlucha might kill it. It's a Zigzagoon. Hawlucha would definitely kill it. Um, okay, I guess Cypher. Cypher will do. Let's go into Cypher. God, look at, look at, look at Hawlucha already. Um, Minchino might take some big damage, so I don't really fancy going into that. And I did. I think I saw a Vacuum Wave on this thing. Uh, he's gone for the growl. Okay, that means he'll probably live and attack. I don't. I didn't see what attacks I have. I think quick attack. Yeah, technician boost. Come on, don't don't kill this thing. Right, thank you. Whatever we hatch from the next egg is gonna be level two as well. I would like to train Shinchino up along with that thing. I don't like my Pokemon being levels apart. I like them being quite close. It makes it uh, a lot easier on yourself. Right, Zigzagoon. What are you gonna? Please catch it. Because I can't hit it again without killing it, I don't think. Maybe with Shinchino. Minchino. I'm going to get that wrong so many times. Uh, Zigzagoon was caught. Oh, by the way, with, Min with uh, Minchino, I know I forgot to nickname it. What will happen is, I'll probably give it a nickname uh, anyway, in the little uh, layout. And then I will change it as soon as I can, or as long as I remember. And if I don't, you can shout at me. I need to start using the analog stick a bit more. I don't know why I like using the arrows so much. It's a bit weird. Right, let's go and trade in this ziz uh, Zigzagoon for an egg. What could it be? I have no idea. I will be doing duplicate claws, so if, like, I have five cypher eggs, for example. Um, I won't use all the ciphers, so let's go for this egg here. What are you going to hatch into? Be something good. Be something good. Be something interesting. Be something good. Maybe a water type would be quite nice for this rock gym. Well, Lucha is obviously going to help, but we want we want some differences. It's a ah oh, Dratini. Oh, I'm happy. I'm happy with that Dratini. What can I call you? Well, there's only one name I think I can give a Dratini, right? Right? Am I right or am I right? Lance. Right. Let's get you to level two. What sorts of crazy? I hope he has E speed. I hope it has E speed. So you should be level two. Perfect. Yeah, I need oh. Right, let's see what see what lovely moves this thing has for me, shall we? So you're an adamant nature, marvel scale. Pretty sure that turns does that turn into multi-scale? Dragon dance and extreme speed. I love it. I love this Dratini. Oh, it's a shame I that thing is gonna be so broken to start off with. Um Because he's gonna get Dragon Rage. Um, so, yeah. I just got a tweet from Josh saying he has my Electabuzz for me. No, Josh. If you're watching this, no. You'll now know why. Um, right then, I guess, let's, uh, stick Minchino on top. I want to train Minchino up first. The sooner I learn Tail Slap, the better. Um, I think there's a trainer down here, though, right? Oh, no. Oh, no. Well, she just completely told me the wrong thing. She's not a trainer. Oh, wait. Wingle, Wingle. No, I pressed the wrong button. No, I don't want to begin connecting to the internet. I wanted to get them on that. Never mind. Let's battle you. You have a C dot, don't you? Here's like some crazy C dot who just does things. Tell you what, I'll lead off with Minchino. I got it right that time, and I'll go into Dratini and then start dragon dancing things. Then we'll see who's laughing. So, oh look at little Minchino. He's lovely. And that probably sounded really camp. Right, Dratini. Let's go. Let's go, Dratini. Don't have. And he'll have Harden, and he'll have Bide. So I just want him to go for the bide first turn, please. Stop hardening. Don't go for the harden. You're just going to make me go for more and more dragon dances. Right. Let, oh, wait. I can leer him as well. Okay, that's good. Stop hardening. Seriously, C-Dot. Just go for a flipping bide already. Come on. Look at this dragon dancing Dratini. 
without a badge. I love it. I absolutely love it. Right, Dragon Dance again. Hooray! He's gone for Bide. Right, now I can Leer on this next turn, I believe. E-Speed will take out... I'm pretty sure this trainer has a Taylor as a second Pokemon, so we'll be able to take this thing out. Oh, Dratini's just going to sweep through things. Dratini's going to cause havoc. Um, storing energy. Very nice. Dragon Dance. Dragon Dance. I don't know if that's the... I just made that up as Japanese. Look at, look at the beautiful beach. That's lovely. I wonder if that's Mount Coronet in the background or what. Actually, I don't know. Herman's an island. I guess it could be one of the mira mirage spots. I don't know. You're going to unleash energy this turn, are you? You are, and I didn't touch you. Unlucky, C-Dot. Now, ready for the pain train. Lancer's attack. Yeah, extreme speed. It's going to do a lot of damage. Probably won't even do over half, though, will it? Oh, my God. Are you kidding me? Come on! Do I have any special attackers? No, they're all physical! Oh, come on. Leer! I'm gonna make this the longest battle in the world. I promise. I promise. Right, let's just keep leering. I mean, Taylor should be able to... Uh, plus three E-Speed should take a Taylor out, right? Even if it is level six. Right. Leer. I guess because we're quite a low level... The, the, like, multiplications of your attack stat aren't too good. Right. Let's Dragon Dance one more time because he's going to unleash energy. He's back down to a plus one, I think. I think I'm at plus four or plus five now. I could have just gone into a uh, Luchette and just finished it off, really. But never mind. Let's Extreme Speed. If he goes for the... Right, isn't... I like Speed if he goes for Bide anyway, so... What's he going to go for this time? Bide. Okay. Right then. Let's Extreme Speed again. Where's my crit? Where's my beautiful crit? Ah, oh, okay. Right, let's wrap, maybe? Or do I risk missing? No, I don't risk it. Let's extreme speed again. There's the E-speed. That's a dead, dead seed. I don't get how Dratini can be fast on land. I mean, obviously, extreme speed is a brilliant move to... Alright, thank you. I was thinking only 37 experience. That's not going to do much for me, but... There you go. Minchino, level 3... Voice break. Baby doll eyes. Very good, Minchino. Taylo, you are not living this extreme speed. I swear, you are not living this. Surely not. Surely not. Unless you might. You lived. Of course. Oh, uh, and before he gets a crit. Um, I have a very, very big uh, flying type weakness, don't I? Oh, wait. I'm, oh, I'm faster because Dragon Dance. Of course. And that's a dead tailor. I think that's the first time I've seen the rap animation in Omega Ruby and Alpha Sapphire. I don't remember that from before. Level 4 Lance. Very good. When do we get Dragon Rage? I want it sooner than later because it makes things broken and easy. I'm standing... Oh, standing? I'm sitting here with a massive grin on my face because I just said I wanted it to be easy. I don't want it to be easy. I want it to be challenging. Let's get back and heal quick. And then we'll make our way to Petalburg Woods where we can catch another new Pokemon for our team. So we could actually, no we will actually have, uh, well as long as no one dies, we can have a full team before we get to Roxanne. And I believe also maybe one or even two spare Pokemon in the box for us. So it's a good start, it's a very good start. Let's go and find our way to the forest then. But first I think what we'll have to do is battle that guy who has a Zigzagoon who he just abuses full restores on. Because he's a rich boy and he fancies, fancies using all his money for no apparent reason. Let's dodge the grass because I've already caught Pokemon. Are you kidding me? Dude, don't do that to me. That guy doesn't battle, I don't think. Does he? No, he doesn't. I wonder what it's like at the bottom of the sea. <laughs> we'll find out. Hey, it's a Wingull. I can finally see one. I've missed them twice, I believe. Hello, Mr. Briony. Ho, ho, ho. My pretty Pico is as full of energy as usual. Is he? My Pokemon is staggeringly tired. I should have bought a potion. Will you give him one of your potions? Hell no. You don't get anything in return. So let's get these berries. Orenberry has two berries. That Orenberry has two Orenberries. Good English, Jack. Good English. Very good English. Let's pick the Petra Berries. There is no reaction. That's brilliant. I didn't ask for a reaction. You stupid machine. Stupid Dex Nav. Go away. Let's uh, fight this guy then. Min Chinchino. No, Minchino has got this, surely. Oh, no, wait. I think this thing will be level 7. So I might not want to stay in. Or Lucha can do some work. 
Or even Cypher can. Because that vacuum wave. That lovely vacuum wave. Uh, this, uh, I wonder if... Does Minchino learn Bullet Seed? If it learns Bullet Seed, that would be brilliant for this gym. But I don't think it does. Right, let's go into Luchette and give Luchette some screen time, shall we? See what's going to happen. Does... Does... Uh, Mm, I'm thinking, does Thingy, I can't think of Hall Lucha, that's the one, does he get Mold Breaker? Well, I'm trying to think what it gets. I can't decide whether it is, because I'm quite bummed if it does, because Mold Breaker would have been lovely to stop all the sturdy abusers in the, uh, in the gym, but hey, Karate Chop, lovely, lovely fighting type advantage at the start of the game, because they're all normal types. Luchette, 96 experience, not bad. Level 4, Minchino. Level 5. Hurry up and learn Tail Slap. Rich Boy Winston. Why can I win? I don't know why you can win. I do not know. I tell you what, I need to get a King's Rock. The sooner I find a King's Rock, the better. Just to give it to Minchino and abuse the flinches. Right, let's find a Pokemon in this grass. What is it going to be? It is a Cascoon. Interesting. Well, at least it can't hurt me while I try and catch it. Um, let's pound this thing then before it gets any hardens in. How much is this going to do? Probably not much. Oh my god. <sighs> this is what I get for having all physical attackers, really. I reckon. Pound again. Critical hit. No. Nope. Wait, did I just use my towel? Towel? Tail to hit that thing. I swear I get some of the most outrageous words mixed up. It's stupid. Um. Let's go into... Let's go into Awesome. He's at plus two now. I could vacuum wave. It shouldn't kill it, right? It's non-stab and it's special. Yeah, I think we're safe to go for a Vacuum Wave. Oh, why did this thing not have False Swipe? Let's go for a Vacuum Wave then. See how much this does. Oh my god, that done less than Pound. I reckon I could try chucking a Pokeball at this thing. I've got, I've got plenty. I've got plenty of Pokeballs. Right, let's go, Cascoon. What have you got on me? And whatever we hatch from the eggs is going to be level 6 too. So that's very nice. Very nice and powerful to start off with. Okay, we might have to do some more damage to this thing. Harden. I bet if I go for the quick attack here, I'll get a critical hit and kill it. So let's go. See how much this quick attack does. The sooner I like can get a bug move on this thing, the better. And Aerial Ace. Aerial Ace would be nice. Where can I get a Metal Coat in this game? I think you can catch Onyx holding them. But I need to go into a lot of it. Oh. Oh god damn it. Never mind, never mind. We'll, we'll carry on, we'll persevere. Um, I think there's an item over here though. In this grass. Here? Hey, it's a potion! I could give that to that little boy, but I'm feeling like an extra mean bastard today, so he's not gonna get it. I can't believe you just killed that cascoon of a critical hit, you stupid cipher. I guess I should have expected it. Um based on the luck I got last video. I guess you could say that was either luck or unlucky, so we'll jump back down here and carry on. I could have sworn there were berries up there before. Well, obviously I was wrong, but... Right, let's go through Pelberg Woods and battle this guy, I guess. Uh, how many Wurmples does he have? I'm thinking I should put Lance on top, but I, I like Minchino. We'll stick with Minchino. We can, we can mix it up. We can always mix it up. Ooh, that... Ah, oh, the little thing. Oh, my Pokénav came up with, like, an exclamation mark. I could have got something cool. Never mind. But catch a Lyle. Sent out Wormple. Right, this pound should do enough damage for it to be a two-hit kill. Purely because stab. I have them baby doll eyes just in case uh, this, this Wormple gets a bit too scary for me. Alright, pound. How much is that going to do? Oh my god, it's not even a three-hit KO. No, it is a three-hit KO. Minchino, I thought you were going to be powerful. I'm not happy with that. I'm pretty sure the person who bred this is a failure at life. Well, to be fair, I did ask for non-IV bred, but well, I said you could IV breed them if you wanted, but some of you did, some of you didn't. So Wormple fainted, that's one. 60 experience. Oh, I could say, I'm going to stay in and kill the next one. Hopefully this one's a two-hit KO. Min-max damage? Maybe it's a, that, I bet that last Wemple had two, 252 EVs in defense. Pound, oh my god, that doesn't even less! Minchino, you're a, oh my god, what the hell? Minchino, I swear. Well, even if it's a critical hit on the next one, he can't kill me with it. In before he does get another one, though. No, he didn't. That's okay. Right, one more pound should kill this thing. Very good. Wemple's gone. 
I'm just going to go into Hortlucha for the next one, just so I can just finish it. Wurmple is too strong for me. That's not a good presence for the rest of the, like, series, is it? Because helping hand, absolutely wonderful, Minchino. I don't know when that's going to come in handy, but... Ah, you never know. Um, I could go into Cypher. And I need, yeah, I need to level Cypher up. Let's go into Cypher. Quick attack this uh, Wurmple to death. Now, what if Quick Attack with Technician does more than Holucha? I guess it does. I imagine Cypher has a higher attack. Um, let's quick... Oh, my God. Look at this. Cypher really fits in with the background, but that Wurmple's tiny. That's going to die to another Quick Attack, which is nice. Very nice. Tackle. Why is Wurmple doing free damage to me? I don't like it. Although, he is level 5 and I'm level 5, so I guess it's not really too bad looking at it that way. Right, Wurmple's dead. I don't know if I can be bothered to get back to the Pokemon Center or not. I have enough potions just to heal up in the forest. Awesome Green level 6. I mean, defeated Bug Catcher Lyle. I have all these Pokemon, but I can't win. Yes, it's because they're all little crappy worms. Alright, let's heal up a Minchino. And, yeah, I went and bought a Antidote. Yeah, I went and bought an Antidote so I could hack in all these uh, rare candies without actually losing my potions. That I'd been mad. Zigzagoon. Okay, Minchino, run away. Minchino, listen to me. Run away from this thing. Thank you. Right, I need to... I want to put Dratini on top. I really do. Paralyze heal. Hey, very nice. Uh, especially as I don't have that um, shed skin. I believe this will actually be a multi-scale Dragonite. If I even get a Dragonite. I might not even have a Dragonite by the end, by the end of the egg lock. Or by the Elite Four. Because it's be level 55, it evolves. Hmm, not one to be found. Hello, have you seen any Pokemon called Shroomish around here? I really love that Pokemon. That was like the least swaggiest walk I've ever seen. I was going to ambush you, but you had to dawdle into Petalburg Woods forever, didn't you? I got sick of waiting, so here I am. You, Devon researcher, hand over those papers. Oh, sorry, I've just burped and hiccuped in the space of 10 seconds. You're a Pokemon trainer, aren't you? You've got to help me, please. Huh? What do you think you're doing? What? You're going to protect him? No one no one who crosses Team Mac will get to any mercy, not even a kid. Come on, battle me. Okay, then. So, it looks like we're battling the Team Aqua Grunt. Say hello to the bad guys of Pokemon Alpha Sapphire and enjoy the wonderful music that is their rival theme tune kind of thing. I love this. This is, like, my favourite bad guy music ever. Right, so what level's the Poochiena? It's level 9. Not a chance I'm leaving Lance in. Let's go into Luchette. Because we can karate chop that thing to death. And hopefully... No, it will kill. It's a Poochiena. Luchette needs... Actually, I need to train Luchette up before the gym. I think Luchette can do the gym on its, on its own. Karate chop. Let's go. And that's a dead Poochiena. Very much a dead Poochiena. And it's nice that Karate Chop has that high critical hit ratio too. 108 experience. Lance Crew level 5. Thunder Wave. That'll be very nice to help catch some Pokemon. So I'll let him get Leer for that. I would like to get rid of Rap, but as I have E-Speed as my only attack and move with 5 PP, I don't think that'd be the smartest move right now. Yeah, you're crazy strong. May receive 360 Poke Pounds, Dollars, Yen... Euros for winning. Okay, you've got some nerve meddling with Team Aqua. Come on, battle me again. Well, I just kill you with Horlucha again. That simple. Whew, that was awfully close. Thanks to you, he did not rob me of those important papers. I know, I'll give you this as my thanks. So is this Professor Cosmo? I don't know if it is, because I know Professor Cosmo has a lot more of an involvement in this game, but I don't think it is. No, nah, it can't be. Why would Professor Cosmo be in the middle of a forest? Hey, he healed my team for me. You had your Pokemon set? Yes, I know. Ah, that team at could Fug say something about something in Rustborough too. Oh, it's a crisis. I can't be wasting time. It appears you can be wasting time, my friend. Right then, let's carry on through this forest, shall we? Um, oh. Let's get something off. I imagine it was a Cascoon or a Silcoon or something. Let's lead off with Lance again. And then we'll just go straight into Luchette, the Horlucha, to kill this guy off. So, you're challenged by Bugcatcher James. Bugcatcher James sent out Linkada. 
Right, Ninkada does not scare me at all. Not at the slightest. But he'll just harden up again. Because that's what they do. Let's go into Luchette. It'd be nice and level 10. Before we even get to the gym. Actually, normally I think my Torchic would be about level 10. By the time I'm at Petalburg. Um, yeah, definitely would be level 10 by the time I get out of Pet Not Petal... Yeah, by... Why... I cannot speak today. By the time I am at Petalburg and you meet your dad, my Torchic or Starter would normally be level 10. So I guess we are... Uh, we're not under leveled because all the opponents' Pokemon are like high levels too. I really wish they'd made this remake harder than the originals, but I don't think they did. I think it's easier. Some of the the uh, mechanics would like change in future generations really like change this game, um, but it hasn't made it tougher in every case. The start's quite tough because I think the Pokemon are higher levels, like trainers, but the gym leader's Pokemon are weaker. I'm pretty sure of it. I'm pretty sure Brawly always used to give me trouble, even when I had a Taylor that was like four levels higher. That Makuhita could cause all sorts of problems, but it's just not the same. You can take it on with Routes purely because it's a fairy type and it resists quad resists the fighting moves, so it's quite easy to take down with Routes. But in the old games, it was so hard to take down Brawly. I always found him an issue. Winona was also quite hard as well. Um, let's get away from the Zigzagoon. And I think we can go get the Squirt Bottle outside of this woods, so that's what we're going to do now. Ooh. This is the Pesselberg Recon Team checking in. I'm afraid I have to begin with an apology, Mr. Matt. It's not good news. The mission is a no-go. At least something cropped up and got in the way. Roger that. Got it. Will do. I'll continue investigating that energy we detected. Phew! That kid sure had some promises as a trainer, I'd say. Now I've seen it through... I wonder if that's Zinnia. I really do. Do you give me anything? What's up? I like to shout my lungs out, so it feels so good. It feels good, so you can have this. Go try it out. Use it on a Pokemon and it'll learn a move that attacks with its voice. If the move is used several times in a row, it becomes more powerful. Hey, Echoed Voice! Not bad! Our first TM of the game. A word of advice a technical machine can be used many times. It won't go away, so try it out as many times as you want. Cool. Right, let's pick these berries. That this shop has obviously uh, planted for decoration purposes and not for people to steal. Because we're nice like that. Sherry Berry. Okay, I have a feeling I should probably give an Orange Berry to like Polucha or something. I'm really I'm really worried. I don't know how well I'll take like rock type moves with Polucha. I'll hit hard, but they all have sturdy and it's really annoying. Um No, go away. I wanna mm, I wanna talk to all these empty spots, because I know some of them have uh Items hidden away in them. So, go Lance. Look at the beautiful trees. And the leaves that fly across as well. They're... Why can I not run away? Just let me run away, please. I really need a special attacker. No, no this is not... This is the same route as we caught the Pokemon that we swapped for Dratini. So, I can't... Um, can't catch that wing girl and have it on this team, sadly. Or have the egg that I could trade in for it. Um, let's... Uh, this will have an item. Does it? No, it doesn't. Right, let's pick this up. Oh, come on. I didn't want to find any more wild Pokemon. Especially you, Wurmple. You've annoyed me enough this video. Come on, Tratini. We can do this. Run away. Hooray! Wow, I went past level 7. I should have waited to catch Pokemon this side. They're much higher level. X attack. Okay. That's nice, I guess. Put the X attack in the item's pocket. Right. Oh, come on. Why? Why, God, why? Right, we should be able to get out of this grass. I think what I'll do is I'll battle some trainers, and then when I get to Rustboro, it'll probably be the end. About half... Oh, I'm nearly half an hour. Can I... Hooray, I got out of the grass. So I think I should probably lead with... I need... I should probably start doing more with Luchette. Um, that'll, do, that'll do for now. Yeah, definitely. I don't care. I'm just going to focus on Luchette for now. She'll help. Or, yeah, it'll help the first two gyms. Massive. Oh, wait. I was going to battle these, wasn't I? Yeah, I'll battle you. Um, but the third gym, I've got... What have I got? Dratini is going to resist a lot of things, actually, which is really helpful. However, I've got fly two flying types. Two flying types already. I need. I want a ground type. What could I have? Like a drill bar or something would be very nice. Let's go for the 
You're level 10. Holy poo. Luchette, you can you can handle this. I don't feel safe staying in with Trutini and just dragon dancing. As soon as I get Dragon Rage. Whew, as soon as I get Dragon Rage. I wonder if Dragon Rage bypasses Sturdy or not. Because it does 40 HP damage guaranteed. So I wonder if the Geodudes had like 38 HP. I wonder if it would kill them or not. That'd be interesting to see. I don't know if, if anyone's ever tested it before. So, Lucha, you're not going to go anywhere near level 11. Jesus Christ. It's going to be a slow, like, grow at start off of... Wait, when did I get the EXP share? Oh, that's what the scientist gives you, isn't it? Uh, okay, it's not too bad. At least everything will get some levels now. Should I or shouldn't I? Okay, sure, I will battle. I'll tell you what. If this egglock turns out to be, like, in the next few episodes, turns out to be quite easy, I will turn the... EXP share off to make it harder because there's no fun in having a really easy uh, lock variant, is there? But then again, I have got a Dratini before the first gym badge, so I guess I can't really say anything. Um, Lotad, what are you going to do? Let's go into Luchet. Because why not? Because why not? We can wing attack this. Pretty sure she has a Shroomish as well, so we can wing attack that to death. Look at these beautiful flowers in the background. I'm half expecting a Shaman to pop out of nowhere. From the beautiful grass, frolicking along. Wing attack, do some damage. Do damage, thank you. That low tad is dead. Critical hit. So this video has definitely not been as hacksy as the last one. Which is kind of good. I don't like getting too much hacks, it just makes me think something bad's going to happen. Oh, Minchino needs to hurry up and learn a move that isn't pound. I don't know when, I, I imagine it doesn't get tail slapped too late on. Let's go for another wing attack. In before effect spore. In before effect spore. Oh, oh. Uh, called it. I, I actually just called that. I am quite proud of my... Because I called the critical hit and the burn. Kind of. I asked for the opposite and it, and it gave it to me. Good job I picked one of them berries, hey? I believe I should have about four of them by now. Oh, that antidote I bought uh, would, would come in real handy right now. Oh, didn't mean to do that. I trade. I swapped over my... Key items with my berries. Let's use that on Luchette. And when we get over this lake, we'll pretty much be in Rustboro. Hey, double battle. Who have I got on top? I suppose I should lead with Luch Luchette. I keep on calling it Luchador. I shouldn't have called it Luchette. And uh, Lance can start first off. You're the joint weakest along with Cypher. But Cypher is going to be powerful, whatever. We're twins, so we battle Pokemon together too. Alright, you're going to battle our Pokemon. Let's see how this goes. I think it's a low tad and the C dot. It is a low tad and the C dot. So I'm going to take what is more threatening to me. I don't think any of them are. I don't think C dot can even touch us. So I'm just going to. Uh, what should I do? I guess I'll wrap C dot and I'll wing attack low tad. Seems like the most sensible. Oh, there's the bide. It doesn't bother me that it's gone for bide this time because wing attack and E speed. We'll definitely take that thing out, surely. I mean, wing attack, stab. Lu Luce is just powerful. 84. Luce green level 11. Nice. Very nice. Uh, no one else green level, though. Right, let's wrap this thing. Don't be silly. Wrap your willy. Right, C dot was wrapped. And you get more wrap. I wonder if that wrap damage, like, afterwards contributes towards the uh, abide damage output. Let's wing attack and kill this thing. I have got Detect. So that could be fun. That E-Speed didn't do much. Storing energy. As long as wing attack. Wing tackle kill. Wing tackle 110% kill. Fret averted. Fret averted. I know there's a Fisher on the next or on this route too. But I'll probably skip him because it's just Magikarps. What is the fun in tackling loads of Magikarps? Quite literally tackling loads of Magikarps. I'm so disappointed that we lost. Give me your Pikachu dolls, bitches. Nope, okay. Let's continue on. I'm going to dodge that Fisher, but there is a lady over here, I think. It gives you berries. Oh, there's more berries to pick, too. More, four berries. I like how the trees are. They're a lot more generous than the old ones. Or, the trees were always generous if the berries were completely useless, other than used for uh, the Poke Contest. That's a thing, actually. I need... If I get to the end of this... Well, if I fail this Egglock, I'll just carry on anyway, because there's, I don't want to waste time getting halfway through it. Um... I'll do loads of bonus episodes, like maybe, um, maybe doing some contests, 
getting to the master rank and whatnot with one of your lovely egg Pokemon. Um, is it, there'll be an item around here, won't there? Hey, Rustboro City! I believe you don't get any Pokemon here. But what you can do is revive a fossil you get in the desert, which actually works. So you can kind of technically get two Pokemon from the desert. Very interesting. Right, guys, that is it for this episode. We have finally made it to Rustboro. Oh, no, okay, looks like we're going to have to meet Brendan first. So you made it here to Rustboro too, mate. Eh? Well, no, I got lost and ended up in, I don't know, Iraq. It's a real city, huh? Nothing like Little Root. Oh, did you know there's a gym here too? As soon as I gather a few more Pokemon, I'll be trying my team against it. See ya. And with that, we can finally end the episode, guys. Next episode, we'll be taking on Roxanne, and we'll be getting a few more Pokemon, and I will be collecting the HM for cut while I give you my outro. Thanks for watching this video, guys. If you enjoyed, do leave a like. Um, I probably didn't put in too much F... Well, no, wait, that's not effort's the wrong word. I don't think I'm as, as enthusiastic. I got knocked out earlier at football, so it's quite a surprise that I'm even up and doing this, but... I'm also going to go and do episode 3 straight off because I want to get some done uh, in advance for while I'm away over Christmas. I'm at my dad's house for a few days, so the sooner I can get stuff done, the better. So thanks for watching this video, guys. Leave a like if you have not clicked that like button already. If you are not subscribed to me, a subscribe will be very much appreciated. Other than that, guys, I hope you enjoyed this video, and I'll see you next time. Bye.